A heartbreaking case of animal neglect tonight. Buncombe County officers say a poodle was found matted, muddy, and covered in maggots. Yeah, they were worried about his survival. News 13's Megan Sharing joins us with tonight's top story. And Megan, you were there as veterinarians worked desperately to care for the dog. That's right, Tammy. The Asheville Humane Society says this is one of the worst cases of animal neglect they've ever seen. And they're crediting the Buncombe County Sheriff's Office for taking quick action. We want to warn you, the video you are about to see is graphic. It's definitely not a good situation for the dog to be in that condition. His new name is Magic. Uh, this is his foot. He's an innocent poodle that's made an unbelievable recovery after suffering what animal experts believe to be is a life full of neglect. The white specks that you see are actually maggots um, because the, underneath the fur it's wet and moist and it, it attracts flies, which they larvae. The Buncombe County Sheriff's Office brought him to the animal shelter Tuesday night. Immediately, staff members could tell magic was in poor condition. Honestly, it really did break my heart and my heart really went out to him because just to know that, you know, wasn't something that happens overnight for a dog to be that mad. In. He was rushed to Animal Hospital of North Asheville where veterinarians began working to save his life. It's so wet. The clippers are just not for there easily. You have to be really gentle and I'm not to damage the skin. To treat him, Magic was sedated. Vets say he was covered in mats, mud, and maggots. With over 50% of his body battling infection and inflammation, he should be okay. Now it's the hope of the Asheville Humane Society that this poor puppy will have a happy ending and that they'll never have to see another animal in this condition ever again. Very hard to watch. Well, I'm told once Magic has made a full recovery, the Humane Society will place him up for adoption. Meantime, the Buncombe County Sheriff's Office tells me they are investigating this case.